Today we head to Kimmerer, Wyoming, home of the first J.C. Penney store. Yep, I was there, and this whole place is about fossils, and that's what we're going to do. We're going out fossil hunting. Kelly and I were joined by Richard and Lark, and we were going to spend the next two hours at this quarry splitting rock and hunting for fossils that we'd put on those carts. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. They have a place there that shows some of the fossils that you might find. I wanted to find a turtle fossil. 52 million years old. What so, were they? Nydia and Diplomistus. The palm frond. This is turtle poop. And we poop. get uh, very wow. few materials. And what we do is we split it as far as it'll let us go. Now, when you get a big piece, it's going to have moisture on the inside. Because it has moisture, it's not going to split that far. Yeah. So when you're done with your piece and it won't split anymore, do not throw it on the ground. Don't break it. Don't walk on it. Just. We received instructions, and these were some of the rare fossils that we might find. Though, typically, we just find the fish fossils. I still had hopes of a turtle fossil. After we received all our instruction, showed us where the saws were to cut the rock, I still had my eye on a turtle fossil. We headed out to start splitting stone. And you'll see we're kind of bundled up. Okay, Kelly Paul, where are we? We are in the American fossil, fossil, fossil. I'm a fossil. Hey, right. Us old fossils are looking for fossils. Take you over here to Richard Lark. There's Richard. Lark's working away hard. Fossils. Isn't this more fun than you could possibly have? Oh, yeah. There's some broken fossils Richard has. Okay, we'll see if there's anything in this one Lark's doing. You'll see it first here. Open that sucker. Nothing. Nothing. Typical. We'd spend the next couple hours in, well, basically freezing weather. I think the temperature is about 34. Out there splitting rocks, looking for a rare fossil, or even a real good fish fossil. This is one of the few sites that lets you keep all the fossils that you find. If it's a fossil that's rare and worth over $100,000, Hey, Richard, you have to split way. the proceeds with the facility. <laughs> Unfortunately, we didn't find any of those on this visit. But I'll tell you, it's kind of like gold fever. We had fossil fever, and we just went around splitting rocks. There's a few on my tray. Again, all I found were fish fossils. But they mine the rock right out of the side of the wall, put it out there to let it dry. Once it's dry enough, then we come split it looking for fossils. I guess you could say it was some old fossils looking for old fossils. Okay, Richard, where are we? We are in a fossil quarry. And we've spent the last two hours uh, taking pieces of the material, splitting it in half, and hopefully discovering fossils. Keep going. We're in Kimmerer, Wyoming, or thereabouts. And this is the fossil quarry. We loaded up our fossils, and if the rocks were too big, we took them over here and sawed them down so we could load them in our car and haul them away. But American Fossil Quarry, that's where we were. 
We had a great time. Kelly wanted to stay a little longer. I think that would have been him if I would have let him. But we went back into town, had lunch, visited some of the fossil stores to see some of the fossils that we could have found, but didn't. But it's just an amazing thing, a lot of fun, because you just never knew what you might come across. But we gained a new pride for the fossils, and it was cool to see them. So I hope you enjoyed our trip to Kemmerer, Wyoming, and hunting for fossils. And after we were done with that, we decided we drive down to Bryce Canyon. We got there late in the day, snapped a few pictures, and watched the moon rise over the canyon. Spectacular. Another great day. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.